today um we are going to be reading uh second corinthians um 12 9 um paul's vision and his form 12 i must go on boasting there though there is nothing to be gained by it and i will go to visions and revelations of the lord i will know a man in christ who 14 years ago was caught up to the third heaven whether in body or out of the body i do not know god knows and I know that his this man was caught up into paradise, whether in a body or out of the body. I do not know. God knows, and he heard things that cannot be told, which man may not utter. On behalf of this man, I will boast. But on my own behalf, I will not boast, except of my weaknesses. Though, if I wish to boast, I would not be a fool. For I would be speaking the truth, but I refrain from it so that no one may think more of me than he sees in me or hears from me. So to keep me from becoming conceited because of the surpassing greatness in the revelations, a foreign was given in me in the, given me in the flesh, a messenger of Satan to harass me. To keep me from becoming conceited, three times I pleaded with the Lord about this, that it should leave me. But he said to me, My grace is sufficient for you, for my power is made perfect in weakness. Therefore I will boast all the more gladly of my weaknesses, so that the power of Christ may rest upon me. For the sake of Christ, then I am conceited with weaknesses, insults, hardships, persecutions, and calamities, for when I am weak, then I am strong. Alright, um, that is the scripture, and I'm going to be doing um a, a prayer for you um about... If you're feeling like that, you've been feeling like um, Paul here, um, that you've been struggling in, um, that, um, and that you've been through this hard time, let me pray for you about this, about that God will um, know that his grace is sufficient for you and that his power is made perfect in your weakness. Lord, I just ask that this person on the other screen, Lord, that... Um, they would um, know that their grace is su your grace is sufficient for you in them, Lord, and that you would empower them, Lord, in their weaknesses, and that they would boast about their weaknesses, Lord, and that you would help them, Lord, and give them their strength, for when they are weak, they are strong in you, Lord, and it is in the mighty name of Jesus we pray, and we say, amen. God bless you, brothers and sisters. God bless you. Have a wonderful day or night. God bless you.